week four, day two. I have a story about brownies for you. Actually brownies, frappuccinos, mini Reese's peanut butter cups, cookies, especially chocolate chip cookies, or peanut butter chocolate chip cookies. See how they take the Reese's thing and put it in a cookie? It's just such a lethal combination. I'm Jordan Blacara, and this is an excerpt of My Tales from the Scale. I was talking to Mary Elizabeth, and she said this really resonated for her, and although she doesn't use food anymore, she was looking for her equivalent. I will say that I could substitute work for what I'm gonna tell you about brownies. I could substitute TV. I could st substitute validation and approval from other people for this several times, and I've been overeating that scrumptious food has been the highlight of my day. So I have had day, because I'm not uh, working on my business, I'm not really engaged, I'm not feeling passionate about anything, I'm not creating passion about anything, I'm hiding because I'm afraid to share my voice with the world, or with you. <laughs> when I'm not living my life fully, and not creating, a life I love and projects that I love and feelings of pride and feelings of confidence and and feelings of passion when I'm not doing that I can't blame myself for wanting to reach for television for some Netflix Downton Abbey something on television to to create some kind of drama and interest and intrigue and some kind of entertainment and some kind of peak in my day. So many times that's been food. It's been what I can get in the Starbucks pastry case. I can I can think back in school, you know, when I was struggling socially. Yeah, I'll have a glazed old-fashioned donut from the from the cafeteria. That's better than than feeling like a reject, feeling rejected and and dejected and lonely but I don't want a life where brownie is the peak of my day. I don't, a, a frappuccino from Starbucks, an ice blended from the coffee bean, a slab of cake this big from Vons. I don't want to live a life where that is the peak of my day. I have some other work to do. I have work to do on my life, on what I'm creating, on moving past my fear, stepping out on being more vulnerable and being more connected to people if brownies are the peak of my day. And it is just the frank truth that there have been days where chocolate chip cookies, peanut butter chocolate chip cookies, mini Reese's, mini Reese's peanut butter cups have been the highlight of my day. So the idea is we don't want to, we don't want to move one escape, one artificial joy for another. So I could move, move the food out, but I could just substitute that for HGTV marathons, for a fixer-upper marathon, Netflix binging or Amazon binging. And, and that's not what I wanna do because I don't want to live a life where I am looking for something to escape my life to. You know, that I have a life that I'm escaping from where I just don't want to be present and, and alive and engaged with my life because it's not, entertaining and appealing to me. And so I'm going and looking for something gratifying. And you can't blame me. You can't blame me. We want to feel good. So so if Downton Abbey is like all I got, I'm going to go watch Downton Abbey. What I've been working on is not having just Downton Abbey, not just having frappuccinos and really engaging in my life. And it's so much better. The feeling of pride and passion and commitment and dedication Oh my gosh, so much better than relying on a brownie for the joy in my day. For access to all of My Tales from the Scale, go to mytalesfromthescale.com.